Happy birthday, Nano Duck. Happy birthday. Between sanity and today, I'd like to say happy 90th, 90, 90 birthday, 6 9, June 9th, 1934. Donald Duck was born, meaning the first short in which he was featured came out. I think it was called The Little Red Hen. The days keep coming and they don't stop coming. So, first thing I do is I say, hey, do we have any Donald Duck stuff? I go through Miss Lady Insanity's collection. I found the following cultural artifacts that we can look at. The second thing I do is I say, well, is, you know, is anybody doing anything? Is anybody celebrating? There's, of course, all kinds of happy birthday, 90th, 90th year merchandise out but disney also made a short there's a short you can see it's his first full short apparently since 1961 there's a short you can watch on youtube he's struggling to change a light bulb oh yeah it's called uh it's called uh diy donald and diy donald okay and then the next thing i do is i'm like okay what are some cool donald facts I learned some facts, and then I forget the facts. Oh, yeah, he's the only, he's the, he's basically the only official Disney character to have a middle name. I'll have to put it on the screen. It's, his middle name is whatever this little suit is called, that little suit he wears. That suit has a name. That's also his middle name. There's a fast fact, fun fact. And then my mind's just, uh, you know, my mind just kind of, uh, I start thinking about things because I'm like, why, why? I'm, not, I'm obviously not really a Donald collector, but I have a certain affinity for Donald because I suspect we have similar personalities in some way. And I'm like, I bet Donald Duck has ADHD. I mean, he has that temper, notorious temper. He's upbeat despite his bad luck and his bad temper. He's also very optimistic, despite his bad luck and bad temper. Here's the other thing. Here's the other thing with these days, okay? This is more like, like I said, the anniversary of his, you know, cinematic debut, okay? But don't forget, my boy has PTSD as well. My boy was drafted into the Navy in 1941, all right? So if he was born in 34, he couldn't have been drafted in 41. So I'm coming up with a new theory. Oh, I forgot to look up his uh, his Myers-Briggs. But this, this is the theory I was formulating. Because somewhere, in some cartoon, it says his birthday's on Friday the 13th. Hence the bad luck. Now, that, that's not today. That's not June 9th. So I'm thinking Friday the 13th, and he was old enough to be drafted in 1941, and here's another piece, another clue. In the Jim Stone birthday, birthday, Jim birth, birthstone, in the birthstone collection of Disney pins, you can see he represents Scorpio. Okay, so look, look, let's put these three things together. He was draftable age in 1941. He is a Scorpio born on Friday the 13th. We do a little tiny bit of sleuthing, 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 sleuthing on the interwebs. Anyway, he's looking good for 90 plus. You know, he never actually married Daisy. Uh, this was uh, Lady Insanity's perpetual calendar. You sign up for these things. They, you sign up for these things, they're so expensive, and you expect to get, you know, Jan through deck. Then all of a sudden they start sending you more. And you gotta, you gotta cancel when they start sending you these holidays. Anyway, it's fine that she didn't cancel by Valentine's because he's not in Jan through December. Uh, but he represents Valentine's Day. Never married, never had kids. So his sister, name on the screen, is the mother of Huey, Dewey, and Louie. And props to you if you can, if you can just remember who is who. Red shirt playing bongos, 1986. 
blue shirt. He done found a jewel. 1986. And blue shirt again. 1986 has a mask, a Majora's mask. So somebody's missing there. Anyway, what is this, Crossy Road? Anyway, what is this? Disney Dorables? Anyway, what is this? These are the Zoom Zooms. Yeah, okay. Let's think about his... Let's speculate as Myers-Briggs. I am uh, INTJ for reference. I think a long time ago I was INFJ. And they say, no, it doesn't change. It, it can change. Also, who cares? Also, also, what does it even mean? I forget. I know, I know I. I know every time I've taken it, I had I gotten zero percentage toward extroversion. Donald, I'm going to say, is extroverted. Sensing or intuiting. Uh, let's go with sensing. He's definitely ES. Thinking versus... Thinking versus feeling. Feeling? So, so far, he's the opposite of me. I, I, I'm going to say he's E, S, F. And then what's the last thing? Judging or perceiving? I'll go judging. Alexa, is Donald Duck an E, S, F J Who knows who cares Happy birthday my dude So look this was uh, This was Recent This is vintage 86 vintage baby just like this This says uh, shell core 1984 Walt Disney 1986 shell core Sounds like Some kind of music Is this what shell core sounds like Heard of nerd core and country core and Rasta core, kitty core, shell core. Donald bringing it. Yeah, look, look how extroverted. Come on, dude. So he tried to go skiing. This is by applause. I, I don't know what you're supposed to do with this. You can't stand it. But get this, my dude's playing baseball. Vintage. Basketball vintage, but then recently, this was a Dollar Tree Dollar Insanity recent acquisition. He's playing football, not vintage. You dig? And then, come on, race car, race car number three, insanity. Ah, uh, okay. I see a Gemini. Or a Scorpio. I don't know. I should have got, you know what else I should have got? One of those orange juices from the Dollar Tree. Alexa, why is Donald Duck on my orange juice? Let's try to cover this. Alexa, when did Daisy Duck first appear? Happy birthday, dude. Too many more.